consider this next tech tip for the Apple iMovie 9 editing software. This tech tip is to introduce iMovie 9. There we go, there's the pro last project we worked on. But right now what I'm doing is as I move my um, cursor across, you can see uh, the various clips that I have in there. I'm just moving the mouse right now, but I'm going to go up here to show you the help menu, which is right up here. If I go to the help menu, right up uh, on, the, uh, on the top there and click on it, one of the things I can click on is uh, video tutorials. I'm going to click on video tutorials. I get this screen here and we'll um, scroll down here to uh, import, organize, and edit videos, enhance your movies, uh, record and share movies. Uh, they're very effective tutorials. The only one that isn't that effective is importing video from your camera because it's based on um, uh, video sources that have flash drives in them rather than uh, tape, uh, using it from tape. It can be done from tape and that's what we're going to show you here, but otherwise the rest of these tutorials, uh, cropping your video, adding titles, putting transitions in, uh, precise editing, all of these various tutorials are uh, very effective and if you have any questions while you're working on a project, you can reference these tutorials by going up to the help menu and then getting to iMovie tutorial. I click on show project library and then it has all of the various projects that I have. Now in order to go into the edit mode, I go up here and I click on edit project and it switches back to the edit mode. These are clips here, right up here, these are the clips that I have dragged from down here. Now the first thing I want to show you is uh, you have to learn how to bring your clips in from your video. Um, and that is the one item that the uh, uh, iMovie tutorials do not cover very well. So I'm going to uh, find that particular tape that I had here. This is the tape that I used and I will load it into our uh, hard drive, into our uh, deck down here. And um, when I do so, then I will go over here to uh, right, right here. Now you can see that says uh, a picture of a camera there. It's just, we want to click on that. And when we click on that, we will get this screen here. There, that's the screen that, uh, this is what you see if you're loading from a tape-based source as opposed to a flash drive like a flip video or something like that. And uh, it's the stand way we do editing here at SPNN. So uh, I can queue up my video to roughly the area that I want and now I'm going to uh, click on import to bring it in. But it does not immediately start bringing it in. It's really, it'll give us another uh, choice that we have to do and you'll see here, I'm going to click on import. You can see it says save to iMovie to test, that's the, the uh, hard drive that I have, the external hard drive. And then right now it says create new event. But I'm going to uh, add to an existing event. And uh, these are the events that I could add to. The hot dog man, uh, learning events, uh, volunteer picnic. I want to do the volunteer picnic is what I want to add it to it. So I add it to the volunteer picnic. And so um, I've got this set up now. So when I bring this in, it's going to go to my external hard drive. It's going to add to the uh, uh, volunteer picnic events. And uh, now I can click on import and it'll start importing the, um, video, the video that I had. There we go. Don't worry about it looking jerky because it's, uh, it's importing the, uh, and uh, okay, this was a Sparky member. <laughs> now uh, let's go down to, uh, to stop that. And we put in uh, 31 seconds of Sparky there. Uh, so I'm, now that I've got those clips in there, when I'm finished importing, then I click done. And then I go back to um, the screen here. 
which shows all of my events. Anytime I want, I can go up here and close iMovie. I can say quit iMovie. And then I can go back and reopen it. And I see I didn't do any saving. All I did is the done. And I go back here and click on open iMovie again. I get back here to showing our screen here, our main screen. There we go. I'll click on, uh, and that'll open up just like we did before. And um, there, and now you'll notice, and if I zoom in on um, my uh, clip that I just worked on, you can see it's, it's there. Uh, even though I didn't save it or anything, there's, there's a, as I said, there's nothing to do about saving, you just do the done part.